Then, have you separated querying and retraining? So sometimes you hear this complaint, machine learning is too slow to use in production. Okay. The retraining part is the slowest part. And so if you insist on doing things in the following way, the user comes and wants something from you. You've just finished with the previous user. You've just gotten the data from the previous user. If you now take that data point and you start retraining the whole thing based on that data point and you say to current user, whoa, 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 we just have to wait five minutes while I make my adjustments, then of course the user is going to be long gone. So instead, what you should be doing is keeping these things separate. Retraining is happening in an attic somewhere where the users are not seeing it on the fly, unless you have some specific algorithm that's really, really fast. But if you don't, separate the two, retrain over there in the attic, and then when the egg timer goes ding, new model is ready, test it, of course, and then plug it in, change the engine in flight so no user ever sees the bump. So you don't have to think of this as a bottleneck piece in your pipeline. 